Right now, on to the Knights and a fantastic achievement to make it to week two of the NRL finals last year. Coach Adam O'Brien and also Captain Kalen Ponga will be hungry to go a step or two further in 2024. Um, but what just what do they need to do to possibly go to crack into that top four, to go that extra inch? We're seeing them get there and, I mean, they had an amazing run at end of season last year. Can they continue that going into this season? I hope so. It'll be off uh, the back of Caelan Ponga's brilliance. Like that's, um, he was the huge catalyst for their turnaround in form and probably uh, saved O'Brien his job. I think, <laughs> you know, the, most people were expecting him to to be gone, and then all of a sudden, um, Caelan Ponga, who had, um, you know, an indifferent start to the season with a number of different issues, and um, just grabbed that club by the scruff of the neck and said. I'm going to take control of this. You're going to come with me, and you know that's why he uh, capped the season off with the with the Delhi and winners medal. He was so good. So, you know, we speak often about consistency of clubs, of teams, but of players. If Kalen can reach those heights again, but for for every single round that the Knights playing, they they're going to be a threat. And they've got some great players in and around him as well. You look at Bradman Best, when he came back from State of Origin, he was he was a, a new player. Yeah. So, um, yeah, players like him, but it's, but it's all on KP. And you know, hopefully uh, Braley can be fit as well for, for the majority of the season. I think um, he, he'll be really important because they've got some great forwards, the Saifiti, Saifiti boys, Frizzell. They're a dangerous outfit, the Newcastle Knights. But, you know, they, in terms of making the top four, they just left left it a little bit too late to, to get into that top four. Yeah, well, I mean, they'll be looking to make a different start to what they did last year. Uh, the first start of the season was horrific, wasn't it, Paulie? Yeah, so basically we've got a stage where at the start of the year they lost a lot of close games, they figured it out, and then they came rushing home. This year they start with the same game that they that the rate that finished the Raiders season essentially. So Knights v the Raiders, what a great round one clash! It's yeah. up there in Newcastle. It's going to be essentially for all the marbles because the Raiders will want revenge. Can they get off to the better start? And then when we look at the back end, they had the nine game winning streak. No coincidence, five of those last eight games were at home. They've got three of their last five at home this year: the West Tigers, the Titans, and Dolphins. None of those teams made the finals last year. They'll be thinking again: if we can be there or thereabouts, we'll be able to make a run at the end. And, and maybe the difference, the top four, as opposed to just the top eight.